Greetings and welcome back to Autonauts. I'm Catherine of Sky and I'm really excited because today we have a major, major update. Um, and I'm kind of excited about this because we also have a roadmap from the Autonauts team. So I have to admit, I did not know that there was so much content still coming. Um, but the devs have released a roadmap of what is going on. And today we got phase one, the agricultural revolution, or at least the, the November portion where we have new recipes and we have new apparel and we have gnomes. Yes, we have Gnard and Gnard. Garden gnomes? Garden gnomes. I like that better. Anyway, I want to figure out how to get them. So let's find out. I think we have this. Is this new? I think this might be new. I'm pretty sure we have bashed many fruit trees already. Bash the trees, planted the apples, and stored the apples. But hopefully, we're going to get those going as well. Uh, we might not get the planting because we already did that. But I know there are some new things. I wonder if there are new texts. Let's see. Let's see. Are there any new things? Are we, are we newing? Hello, Gnu? Gnu. Where is that garden gnome? Gnarden gnome. Hello? Where are you? How do you, wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, oh. The auto not appear I ought to have it. Let's see. Garden. Nope, it's probably gnome. It's probably just under, yeah, they're like gnome raw? Whoa. That sounds rough times, man. Okay, so crude clay station. I already have these guys unlocked. And then they're painted apparently. So you get your raw gnome plus a kiln equals a finished gnome. I like this. We also have hats beyond hats, folks. We have a billion of them. We have a Mad Hatter hat and we have acorn hats. Yay. And we have other hats, cloche hat, adventures hat. I think the adventures was in there. Wake one. Oh, we have wigs now. Wow. Okay. And we have clothing of all kinds. Oh my God. That apron is so cute. I need to have all of, I want all of my like cooking bots to wear an apron. <laughs> Wouldn't that be cute? <laughs> that would be hilarious. Okay, sewing station. We also have jumper variants and clown dungarees. Guess what? We also have a Caladorn making coffee if you can hear that downstairs. But anyway, we also have variants. Bot head mark one variant three. Yes, we now have Rosie from the Jetsons. I remember that one. We also have other variants here. We have this bot. This is a Mark 1 variant 2. Oh, yes. Oh, those are the Daleks, I think. Yes. And then we also have this one. That looks so familiar to me, and I can't remember where the heck it's from. Well, anyway, we'll figure them out. How? Oh, we need transportation for this one. Metallurgy for that one, but we can make some rosy bots. And I want to make some of these as well. These are so cute. In fact, I might make a special bot today. We'll see. Anyway, we want to bake the bot head variants for Rosie. Remember, she was doing a lot of the kitchen cooking and cleaning and stuff and things. Yes. So we'll hopefully have a I don't know, we'll we'll figure out some stuff to make for her. Looks like these are already full. Wow, the bot stations are very happily full of bot stuff. Can I can I copy these? Oh my gosh, there are there are things that are unhappy here. Oh yeah, they're fine. They're fine. Oh yes, we were making crude toy stations. Sorry about the lack of Autonauts videos, everyone, but I have been really overwhelmed with um with crazy stuff like uh, Automation Empire, which is really a fun, fun game. Very different than what I thought. Ended up being a lot of fun though. Can I, let me duplicate. Do I have an extra one of these guys in the world? Yes, I do. Check that out. But we need some floors. And we also, I really do want to set up those saws today. That would be nice. That would improve our throughput immensely, I believe. So we had some flooring somewhere, I believe. Is this it? Is that floor, that sandy track, I think, not crude flooring. Oh, here's some, here's some, here's some. So let me grab and move this stuff. No, oh, not this, no, no, no. Let's get ourselves an area to select. I think we just need four tiles. We'll just move them around properly once we get over here. And there we go. Now, I have to admit, it is completely my fault that you can hear the coffee machine in the background because I forgot he was getting a cup of coffee and I just like so excited to start. I just thought I would. So anyway, let's make ourselves a Rosie bot. Uh, all right, so one log, plank, and pull. 
me just drop off my uh, data disk. There we go. Place that there. Log, plank, pull. Let's get one of each. You can have two different items in the backpack, which is very nice. All right, drop these off over here. I have to say, I've been watching Avon's series, uh, Avon1017. His link is in the description below. I have actually added it. Yes, I have. And uh, anyway, he has the best ways of like, I don't know, organizing things, doing things. It's so fun to watch him do stuff. And because he does something, does things a little bit differently than I do, it's like, wait a second, it never occurred to me to do that thing or another thing. So it's quite fun to watch his series. I highly recommend it. Um, and if you think you've seen all the Autonauts series, you haven't until you've seen his. And it's it's such a funny thing how like, it, and, and like Factorio too, it's like how different people have different styles and play the game in different ways. It makes it so, so much fun. Okay, Rosiebot, come on, darling. You are a Mark I bot. Hello, well, that's nice. Okay, we need a plank and a tree. I was like, why aren't we having like all these materials to carry? Hmm. All right, and then go with this one. Yay, and walk here. Aw, I thought she'd be like a higher level bot because you know, Rosie's like Rosie, man. You know, she's great. Rosie is Rosie. Okay, so where are we assembling these here? Yeah, let's pick up stuffs, put them here. Ah, uh, there we go. And the footsies. Yeah, we gotta get some gnomes. We, we're gonna make gnomes today. We're gonna have Rosie help us make gnomes, I think. Hey, Rosie, Rosie, how you doing, girl? Yay! That's Rosie with the three in her name, because she's very elite. Yeah, yeah. Um, now then, where did we put our... I'm so used to seeing Avon's factory. I'm like, hmm, we have the clay down south. No, we don't. It's up here somewhere. There it is. Uh, right. So we need to be decorating the world with our stuff. So let's go and... That am I? Oh, that I am. There we go. We want to get our data disk because I forgot it. Definitely want to have the data disk with us. Uh, store that. Take the rosy and go over here. So we do have clay getting, so we have 85 of 100. We might need another clay digger as it happens. Let's see what we got over here. We need the fruit stuff going on. Why are we not making fruit? Oh, you know why? Because we have too many apple things already. Jeez. And we're only doing the berry stuff. That's inconvenient. All right, well, the wub is getting processed. I'm very happy about this, but we might have to get some of those things done here shortly. So where am I? <laughs> That's a question I ask frequently, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> uh, I think we need another crude clay station uh, for the thingy majingy. Let's grab this thing. I don't know what this is for. Oh yes, yes, I've heard another thing, that there are patterns available to use. I'm not quite sure how to use those, but uh, yeah, I'm uh, I'm looking forward to trying those out if we can. Let's see if Bo if if Rosie knows how to do it. Can we um, see if you're looking for say one of these, Rosie? Oh, wait, you know what? Let's look for turf instead. Turf is right here. It's sandy. Oh no. Uh, whoops. Hello. There we go. Turf. Select structure. Max area. Okay, so this the patterns are not immediately uh, available, it looks like. I'll have to figure out how to do that. But anyway, um, okay, so let's get this thing sorted out. Let us find, I think it's the crude clay station. So let me just duplicate that if we have one i hope we do why is this here you know what i should do i should turn it around i should turn this thing oh that's a great idea move this one and rotate it can i can i hello yeah like there there you go that's funny it even duplicates the recipe that's very tasty okay we're making gno raw gnomes no, 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 no. I meant to do the box instead. There we go. Yes, please. We need many raw gnomes. 
And I guess this is going to be here-ish. Uh, let me just put this one over there and then put a billion to be constructed because we need more. Definitely need more of these guys. Okay, lots, lots and lots to store, everyone. Lots to store. And I might start making some of those picket fences as well. Those are very, very expensive, though. All right. So I do want to delete this extra storage container that I put down here. I want to duplicate the kiln because we know we need a kiln for stuff as well. Oh, look at how beautifully that lines up. I like this. So then, Rosie Bot, you want to be, you know what? Rosie's a cook, isn't she? She cooks and cleans and does all the things. So let's have a different bot making the raw gnomes and Rosie can cook them in the kiln for us. How about that? That sounds very pleasant. So uh, let's find ourselves a bot. Hello. Hello, Mark II. Come here, please. So what I want to ask you to do, Mark II, is I want you to get four clay out of this thingy-majingy and then put it on the work table. So we'll get this four times. Okay, and then you're gonna put it out there. So let's stop, two, three. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 that's the wrong pots. I swear I didn't do that on purpose. <laughs> Here's where we need to go get stuff. Let's get stuff from here, yes. Four, please, yay. Let's see, times, four times. Nope, not three times, four, thank you. Stop, two, three, four, and then start again, and then place on the table. Slam it down until you spin it into the shape of a Garnarden gnome. Yes, there it is. It is very cute. Um, let's delete a lot of these things. Do this until hands empty. And then, my friend, I want you to take this, find nearest, and pick it up and put it in there and I think I'm just gonna do this I don't know it doesn't really matter how much is in the loop we'll do this until thing empty this thing the workstation empty and then also escape clause on that okay um Oh, 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 we do need to move two out. Oh my gosh, I'm so rusty at this game. I haven't played this game for a couple of days and look what happens to me. Okay, we'll just do this this way then. We'll take that, add to raw gnome storage until hands empty. There we go, and we'll do that forever. Yay. So we're gonna be the Gnarden gnome maker. Yes, I like this. This this makes sense. There you go, have fun. And this thing, I think it only take one at a time. So Rosiebot, how you doing, girl? Here, you come with me. I want you to grab a Gnarden Gnome and you just shove it in. And then once it's done, pick it up and put it in the box. There you go. Boom, do forever. Okay, Rosie. I don't know if that's a zero, if this one has to be a zero. I forgot how Rosie's name is spelled. I think it's maybe this or maybe that. All right, let's go with Rosie like this. Rosie, gnome, firing. Yeah, she fires them. Yep, do the thing, please, girly. There you go. All right, and I have no idea what function the garden gnomes have, actually. <laughs> I have no clue. Um, I think they're just decorative, but they may have an actual function. No idea. Let's put these people in the clay category. Let's see, it's under green people. There we go, clay, ray. All right, and so they're gonna make up to 25 of them. Oh, oh how cute. They are very cute. You know what, we're gonna, we're gonna have some mascots going on here. Let's pick them all up and then have them sitting by the lake. Yeah, they like to fit. look at this. This is a bit scary. Look at this. <laughs> it looks like a very funny t-shirt. Kinda. Oh my god. Alright, so anyway, we have garden gnomes and we can decorate our little village of colonist housing 
with these garden gnomes as well if we want to. I think we should. I think they need some. They need some to, to build up their spirits a bit. I mean, they are just filled with love and all that kind of stuff, but, you know, gotta have, gotta have standards here. We have to have our village of garden gnomes. Hello, Rosie. Thank you. Thank you, girl. We'll take three down there for now, and then we'll um, come back later. All right, we want one for sure. Let's walk there, and I want one over here by this house. Because these, these wee little colonists need their, uh, need decorations. Oh my god, there's a broken home. That's sad times. But at least the, the child got clothed soon, hopefully. Maybe. Maybe it'll happen soon, I don't know. <laughs> Where am I? Oh no, it's taken three years for me to get here. Hello? Where am I? Oh, I'm there. Hello. Alright, there we go. There's one. And... Oh no! <laughs> it's like a gnome totem pole. You know what? I'm gonna leave them there. They look kind of cute. I'll leave them there. Excellent. Um, we're, let's see about these hats again. I'm very curious about some of these hats. Um, what's, what goes well with ponchos, I wonder? I'm gonna find out. Let's see. Let's go back to the hat collection here. These are such funny things. These hats. God. So we have the Chuyo, which of course is the thing. We have crown. Well then. Um, wig. Beret. Mad Hatter hat. That seems appropriate somehow. Acorn hats would be just charming. Or the cloche. Oh, the cloche is so cute. Arr. But I don't know if it really goes very well with the, um, the poncho. This would be nice. I don't know if we have the hat making bunch yet though. I don't think so. No, oh, no, it's level four. Did you see this? Level four. That's not, that's not cool. Butter churn. Oh, there's stuff we don't have. I want stuff. I want all the stuff. Uh, giant water wheel. We need triangular frames. We can make those now. Hello? No, we cannot. Construction technology. Ah, <sighs> okay. It'll be fine. Um, what we do need to focus on is getting the next level of stuffs. Berry jam is probably next. And uh, we need some serious honey making uh, to go along with that. And we also need to set up the forestry things, because that's kind of important. Um, well, I don't know if it's that important. We seem to have tons and tons of... Of... Hello? Why are these trees planted like this? Hello? I guess the bots don't have any more internal grid? Is that what's going on here? Look at this, Dirge. <laughs> the grid has changed. Oh dear. Well, you know what? I don't think we'll have any issues. But you never can tell. I don't know. This is interesting. Do we have it? We have enough acorns. Let's just add another one of those. Let's add another box for acorns. Um, I am thinking it might be good to build, but we have plenty of dung here for fertilizer if we want to go that way. We have so much wool and fleece. How much? Wow, there's clay storage. We need another clay digger, I think. All right, let's go back up there and get a clay digger. Cause yeah, we need, we need mountains of gnomes. Like we need a whole totem tower of gnomes. All right, let's see if we can talk to this bot here. Clay digger bot. Yeah, you. Let's see. We're going to stop you. And then we're going to just steal your program. Yeah. I can't steal when he's like moving. Stop, dude. Stop. Yo. All right. Um, you just dig me up. Go right ahead. Fling the dirt in my face. You see? You see what he's doing? It's very naughty. Look at this. It's like, go away. Go away. I'm not done here. It does take a mountain of time, however, to to process this. So anyway, you do your thing. I'm gonna go and grab two more clay digger bots. Oh, you know what I should have had? I should have had them coming to me. Let's summon them here. Come here, please. Come, there we go. Now they're gonna come along to my location, hopefully. Where did I go? I'm here, where did I go? I'm somewhere. Oh no, oh, apparently I was over here. Uh, sure. Oh, I have no idea where the other one went. I okay. So you're gonna be clay digger, uh, or clay, 
uh, what are we calling it? Clay something. Let's see. I don't know if we're calling it clay harvesting or clay digging or what. Clay digger. There we go. Digger two. Control right click. Uh, oops. All right. Go about your business. Have fun. Where is this bot? That's that one. There's one over there. Did I write the wrong one? <laughs> they were both on the same square. Whoops. Okay. Well, you do your thing. <clears throat> it's fine. And then we'll tell MK2029 that he's Clay Digger. That was funny. Okay, I lost track of that bot, I have to admit. There you go. Ah, <sighs> silly bots. But it's okay. Let's just go up here and put them in our clay category up there. Builders, charge, bot maker. No, 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 no. It's in green. There we go, clay. Excellent. Okay, so. Now one thing we do need to do, we, do we have those seedling trays? I think we might have made one or two. I think we might have one, but I'm not sure. We need to get an apiary going on or a skep. Let's have a skep made. I don't know if this is within our completed or our area of, we can actually make this because it's made out of straw, but we'll try. Let's see. We have that. That's not what we need. Do we have a threshing machine? I think we can make one. We should probably make at least two of them, I think. Do those two there because we don't have any. Mm, this is so nice. I want triangle frames. We have the barns. We have all this stuff. Sure. Ooh, crude arch door with an actual door in it. That's cool. Ain't that pretty. Okay. Mm Here we go. Seedling tray. Did I make one? I didn't make one of these? Really? Hmm. I'm disappointed with past KOS, I have to admit. She's not doing her job properly. This was something she should have done a long time ago. All right, we'll make three of those. I want to find out where flowers come from because I have a sneaking suspicion, and I might have watched Avon's video, that uh, bees need flowers to function. And that makes perfect sense uh, because they are really good at getting um, pollen from flowers. I was just actually playing Bee Simulator um, yesterday. I guess it will be by the time this is published and Bee Simulator video I think is going to be published on the same day. So you get to see both of those in action, but that was quite funny. So let's find out where um, we get flowers. Uh, let's see. Wild flowers are from flower seeds, okay? And you get tilled soil. And then flowers come with a crude scythe. You cut them down and then you get seeds. Okay, sure. And of course we have seedlings which come from the seedling trays and stuff like this. All right, let's go and maybe we need to just harvest some seeds of the flowers that we like. We have asters here. We could have a whole garden. That's what my plan is. The chamomile. Oh, that's nice. These bulrushes. I haven't tried the bulrush fiber. I'm, I admit to being really curious. Primroses are, are orange. Oh, and then of course we have the tulips. I thought those were roses. Are they, I think there are roses in here. These are quite pretty, delphiniums. And these are roses. Those are also lovely. I like these a lot. I think these delphiniums look really quite pretty. Or, best of all, we could do a mixed bunch. I think that might be the best solution, is to have a mixed bunch of flowers. You know what, we might even start over here. So what I wanna do is I wanna create, let's get our clearing, is it clearing team? I don't think it's a clearing team. Nope, I want a the orchard prep team. That's the one I want. Okay, so let's find the orchard sign. I know I have it here somewhere. There's orchard digger sign. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, this is exactly what I want. So what I'm gonna do is we're going to press Z and then we're gonna change the area that this is going to affect. I wanna have it maybe up here. We'll have all the honey stuff up here, I think. 
That is, those are mushrooms. I want to make this area. This is going to be our garden around which we're going to have our, um, what do you call it? Beehives and stuff. So what we want to do is orchard dig in tilled soil. No, we don't want to do that. We'll want to do orchard charge. Yes, you can go. Orchard dig. Yes. Let's see. This is the turf getter. Wow, this is interesting. <laughs> wow, what is going on with this? How, how did this bot get this pattern? I have to say I'm pretty amused by this. Then there's the orchard ho hoeing person. Let me just figure out where did this pattern come from? There we go, alternating. Horizontal stripes. Oh my god, this is so good. This is really good. So you could dig the full thing if you want to. Alternating. Oh my god, devs, this is so great. Vertical stripes. Checkerboard! Ah. Uh, that's nice. That's good. I'm. S you know what? I was just, like dreaming of something like this. I thought we'd have to like program it, pro program it in or something. Um, but no, no, this is great. So now we have to check this out, I guess. All right, so let's stop the orchard dig, but we don't actually need that to happen. Do we? Wait, do we? No, I think we do. No, we need to find nearest soil. We need to actually find nearest turf. Where is the turf guy? Ah, here we go. This is what I need. Okay, so why are they assigned to the wrong sign? <laughs> That's another good question. All right, person. Record, find nearest turf in select structure. Oh, I have to put it down. Shoot. Okay. Uh, put down. No, sign. Delete this. Change this thingy majingy. Edit area, select structure. Do sign, please. Thank you. Yeah, good. Go. So, turf digger is on. Hoeing person. Where are you located with? No, you're on the wrong thing. Why? Why you do? That's really strange to me that they would like, unless I assigned them to that sign, that could be too. So turf storage, again, record, find the turf in, I don't know, land over here. We'll expand the area once the rest of them are done. Let's see, there's our sign, yes. Good, go. So hoeing, digging while hoeing. No, that's fine. I think you're stopped. Charge one is good. Digging tilt soil. I don't think we need to dig tilled soil. I think we're just fine with that. Okay. So I have most of them. That's good. I want to pick up this sign again and put it so we can see the front. There we go. Okay. And so here is where we're going to have our flower garden. And I think I'm going to go and get a scythe for ourselves. There's one right over here. And we can grab flowers that we want. So we'll probably grab these. Probably more of these. Maybe more roses. I want to have like a mixed flower garden. Because I think they're quite pretty. And why not? You know? Why not? Oh, we don't have any of these. We need to get some asters down there. Okay, so let's pick up the asters. Just get the side and cut them down. No! Oh my god, there's only one seed? Aye. That's unfortunate. Okay, we'll take these aster seeds with us. Uh, and then walk over here. And then, you know what I need? Have we gotten transportation research, by the way? There's a, there's a fun item with transportation. No, we don't have it researched. No! <laughs> Where's the research going? What are we doing with our lives? Ugh, okay. Um, there's a really nice item called a wheelbarrow, which you can stack many, many, many things in. And it's quite fun. So let's see, so asters are going to be purple. Let's just drop those there for now. Are there any closer by that I want to pick up? Yes, there are. Good. Okay, come on. Good. Let's go chop these down. Chamomile. Uh, and then we'll get these asters again. What is that? Oh, chamomile seeds. Okay. Yep, just got confuzzled there for a moment. Get the 
these. Oh, we got three of them that time. We'll just dump them here. Okay, and then go up here for the chamomile. Mm. And then we have, I don't know, we've got some roses. This is the primrose. There's another primrose there and more chamomile there. That's nice. Okay, let's just dump these down here. There we go. Hopefully the bot getting the turf is going to come and do stuff soon. Is that this bot, I wonder? Is that is that the bot that's so slow? <laughs> oh yes, it is the bot that's so slow. How nice. There, Chuck it over there. Okay, so then Tilling Bot can do stuff wherever they are. All right, let's keep on gathering a few more flowers here. Here's another. Oh, look at these beauties. Oh my god, gladioli. Hooray. I love gladioli. They're so nice. Are there any other gladioli? No, of course not. No. Game so hard. Game rough times, man. But we did get a lot of flowers, a lot of seeds. Okay, so I'm going to go and put the gladioli over here. We have to remember what color each of these is, by the way. It's a bit interesting from my point of view. But it's okay. We're going to plant the chamomile here. And then get some asters going on. So that's going to be nice over there. And maybe... Maybe over here and there. Okay, and then we'll go gladioli. Probably, I don't know, on the end. Okay, let's just see what that looks like and then we'll we'll get some more. We need some of these primroses. I don't think we have any of those yet. Let's grab these. This is so funny, like designing a flower garden on the fly. It's a bit fun. Fun, fun, fun. One, two, three, and four. Oh, we dung! Wait, dung? <laughs> That's probably not a good word for this. We've got a hen house, hooray! <laughs> we we dung with the hen house. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's add a primrose here and there and there. And then we'll put the stack there. And then these are gladioli. Hmm. Thinking maybe gladioli there. Yeah. Okay. Well, well, we'll keep on going with stuff and see. Uh, hen house. And we also need to get the next, uh, next wove thing. Okay, let's go here and get this built. This is important to get. Whoa, wow, we have, we've got the stuffs and the things. Check this out. Seedling trays. Yay. Excellent. Oh, and we have these guys done. That's perfect. Okay. Okay. Like, life is going well here. Oh, yeah. Let's get a couple of these. I don't know how many we need, but we might need more than one. So let's try two. Um, let's see. Yeah, we definitely need more chamomile flowers. So let's grab this. And over here we have some more. Take these out. That's fun. There we go. That was a naughty bush. Only one, one thingy. And these were here. Oh, there's more to go. Oh, how nice. All right, so then more chamomile here. Actually, we'll pick those up and put one there. Oh, wow, this is looking really pretty. I like this so far. Oh, whoops. Didn't pick up enough. We need more gladioli for sure. And we need more roses. We need more roses. Oh, and there's these as well. There's some delphiniums over there. Let's see. Are there any more roses that we can pick up? somewhere oh here we have stuff We've got two roses here oh, had a tiny lag spike there 
All right, Roses, sorry, we have to scythe you down. I feel like brigands doing this, but for the good of all of us, apparently, right? Sure, sure, we believe that. No, we don't, we don't. We don't believe it at all. There's a stump here, that's interesting. What's out over here? Anything good? No? It's boring stuff, there's a chicken there. Okay, that's, that could be okay. Not, not the favorite find, but it's fine, it's fine. Wow, I can't believe I've spent all this, this entire episode, basically doing a flower garden. <laughs> hey, but what else are you going to do with Autonauts? It's fun! Okay, I'm going to add, I think, some more roses here. I keep thinking of the, uh, the song from the little prince with the roses. That's such a nice thing. Let's see, uh, these are asters, right? So these are the purple ones. Let's put one there. And one here uh, and then what else do we have chamomile I love the chamomile they're very very pretty let's just put that one there I wonder if these all got in the a wrong direction I wonder if you can actually decide the direction by planting them a specific way I guess you probably can I'm guessing but isn't this a lovely little garden for our bees oh we could put a picket fence around it too Oh my god, Catherine's done doing decorating. What is wrong with her? There are things going on with the Catherine that are scary times. Yes, confirmed. It's okay though, don't worry. Um, we'll, we will be fine. Ish. Wait, I have to move. Walk, please. There we go. And... Oopsie, there we are. Here again. No! The rest are purple. No! Do we have any more? Do we have any of these white picket fences, like, hanging out somewhere in the wilderness, ready to be picketing us? Wait, that didn't sound right. Oh, yes it did. Here we go! Let's delete all these guys, put them into our internal storage. These guys don't want to delete for some reason. Oh, those are gates. Okay, that's why. We have a lot of these gates. I think we'll put gates on this, because that seems very fancy, I think. Okay, let's take these. We have 50 fences. And let's see, let's have one here, and then I want one there as well, and then we'll have fences around. Please. Doing it like a different game, <laughs> like trying to do corners on fences. <laughs> silly me, silly me. Okay, let's let this uh, stuff clear up and then we can probably, properly place down our beehives or two. Let's get a skep at least. Down. Here we go. Oh. Maybe here, like that. I don't know if that's cozy or not. It seems cozy, it seems very pleasant, I don't know. So these need a beehive to start off with, apparently. Um, I don't know if the other beehives need it. There's another, like a bee house that you can place down as well. Oh, there's our beehive. There's one beehive. This is the one we've had forever though. I wonder if I can pick it up or do I need to like remove it from the tree forcibly? Like with pliers or something. Oh no, I can grab it apparently. Can I grab more? Can I grab four more beehives? This is crazy with the trees now. <laughs> I find this very funny, by the way. The whole, like, you don't even need other things because this works. I'm looking for other beehives right now. Why? Why? Where you go? Why you dare? No beehives for me. I wonder how to get the other bee house. I need to look that up. Oh, there's one over here. Okay, that one needs to be chopped down. But that's no problem. We just find a random stone lying around and it will be fine. The bees trust me. They're like, yeah, we're fine with this, man. We want to get a new place to hang around anyway. Like, we're cool. Ooh, look what we found. Trace metal deposits. That seems like something we're probably going to need. So I need to remember this. Oh my god, here are the poor bees following me. <laughs> That's funny. That is very funny. Okay, I think we have to chop the tree, as I recall, uh, to get the bees out of the tree. Sorry, bees. We apologize. Chop. Bye. 
And there we go. Now we're carrying two bundles of bees. <laughs> two bundles of bees. Oh my god. <sighs> it happens. It's fine. So we'll go over here and I wonder what's needing... Oh, stone there. Okay, that's good. So I'm going to take these over there and meanwhile, back at the ranch, I'm going to grab this thingy majingy, move it back to our production uh, of building area. Yeah, that, whatever that means. English is not my best language, apparently. <laughs> yeah. Oh, stone cottages. Oh, look at that tasty stuff. Window frames, door frames, chimneys, fireplaces, windows, doors, stone cottage. I feel there's going to be a great consumer need for some stuff here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Don't, don't, don't run off. No, 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 no. Here, here. Drop them in. Here. Yes. And so we have full beehives. Oh, this is great. Oh, this is so nice. Here, bots, where are you? Stop and come here. Stop and come here. Come, come, here, now, now, there you go, good. Oh, this, is, look at them, all oh, those happy bees. They're going from flower to flower and now they're going to their, wow, that's pretty, pretty quick to get stuff here. That's pretty nice, I like this. Uh, all right, so what do we got left? We need to have primroses. I feel like that could go here, sure. This thing, oh, it's still red because we have blueprint. Blueprint, the blueprint of unhappiness, kind of like the bluebird of happiness. Yeah, we have blueprints of unhappiness apparently as well. That's a thing. Here's our new stone cottage thing. This is gonna need stuff. I really wonder what the process for this is. I don't think it's eight planks. I think there are other things going on that we need here. So what does this need? Okay, this needs sand. So let me go move this back to sand land. I'm gonna have to have a permanent sand maker, I think. Or maybe I should just put it in a box or something. That could be a thing. Uh, all right, um, finishing the garden. What do we got here? Asters. Asters are, ah, yes, purple. Probably put those ones over there, I guess. Okay, and then more roses. I'm just gonna put a couple of roses out here, like here. And there, and I want some more of these gladioli over there. Chamomile, chamomile, hmm. Maybe you can go up there, yeah. I would really like some more gladioli though. Do we see any? We could just chop them down and hope we get multiples. That's uh, another strategy we could easily employ. Yeah, that's probably the best idea, I think, because I don't see any other, I don't see any other unique flowers. Oh, we don't have the tulips though. Darn it. We missed out on tulips. We have to go get some of those. I want I want my bees to have access to every flower like in the whole world so that they can make the best and tastiest honey, TM. Excellent. There we go. Over here, over here. Yay. So we'll have one of these tulips over here. Perhaps maybe one here and one there. Okay, and now we're going to shamelessly chop things. Gladioli, sorry, you gotta go, but you're gonna come back. This is like a new life for you. Oh no, the tilling is gone. Oh no. Okay, and then this one as well. Alright, let's get Tillbot. Orchard hoe. Yes, I'm gonna I'm gonna say orchard till. Because they call it tilled soil. It's gonna be just easier for me to remember if I call it till. Until we get there, until tomorrow. Until. Okay, let's grab these seeds. Uh hell their seeds. There they go. No. I don't think I actually got many seeds from this. That's the, the hard part of this process. Yes, I got one. I got one of each. Wow, that was not ideal. Oh no, there's another one there. That's good. So I'm gonna put one there, which is where I intended it to be. And then one over there. Good. 
Are there any other seeds? Don't see any others. All right, so what else do we want here? We have all the ones that we had uh, before. I think we want just more of these gladioli. I believe we do. We don't have many of these either, these delphiniums. We could chop those. Let's chop those down and let those areas get tilled so they look normal. And then our original rose, you know what? That's going to be our rose, like our planetary rose. We're not going to chop that one down at all. Okay, let's put this away and then go and get and plant those. Is that another seed? Oh, it's one I'm holding in my hand. Oh, how handy. But no more delphiniums. Well, that's quite sad. Jeez. I can cut these down, though. Like, yeah, chaos mad with the scythe. <laughs> Ah, yes, not ideal. Oh, hey, we got two seeds though. That's impressive, hooray. I wanna put one here, one there. Uh, anything else we want? I think I really like these yellow flowers. They're very, very pretty, the gladioli. So I'm gonna just keep on chopping those down. Well, that gave us two seeds, that's quite nice. Okay, excellent. We'll chop all these down and then let the the tilling bot till to his heart's content. Oh wow, we got a million of these seeds now. That's very excellent. Quite happy about that. Okay, one there, and then one there. And then we have to have those two. Is that all the extra seeds we have? Is that it? No, there's one there. Very good, very good. That one goes there. So I have two left. Let's have one over there and then one here. I might get another aster. So let's get another aster. Maybe two. So that's two seeds. Okay, I think that was two as well. It was hard to see. There we go. Here's this one and there's the other one. Yay! Oh no, it didn't get, I didn't place it in the right one. Okay. Ah, but there's a gladioli here. Hooray. No, finish tilling. Oh God, the struggle. <laughs> that was really quite funny actually. Um, did I, I thought I had a seed. Oh, gladioli again. How interesting. Oh no, we don't need you. Sorry, go away. Go away. I, no, wait, that's actually wrong. That is wrong, wrong, wrong. I wanted the purple one there. Well, it looks like we'll have to keep chopping down. Keep chopping them all down. Bye-bye, flowers. You had a nice life. It's fun. Okay, was that one or two? can't tell. One. Uh, oh, is that me? Yeah, that's just me. Darn it. Okay, well, we'll put it back. Put it back, they only give us one seed. Dang it. Okay, and this one's gotta go as well. Okay, maybe that's enough. It's one, two. There we go. Now we have more than one. Do we have two now? Aster? They're both asters. Perfect. Oh, this one. I'm trying to go with like a nice color balance for this for this beautiful area and it's like it's perfecting me every time <laughs> anyway I am very happy with our with our areas here we now have full beehives full of honey so we can go and collect that maybe we should collect it now in a a barrel I guess I think it's probably a barrel I don't know seems reasonable um I wonder if we need a good bucket or a better bucket? I don't know. Let's see. Let's get... Oh, and we need to start a new research because I think we got both researches done and we haven't actually finished them yet. Okay. That's fine. What do we need here? Chimney. Oh, chimney and fireplace. Well then. We also need good gears for these things. We have many things happening over here. We got workstations blinking. All the things and like... Hey, KOS, what you doing? Oh, I'm just planting a garden. I stopped to smell the roses and the delphiniums and the gladioli. <laughs> it happens, it happens. 
All right, we do have our threshing machines. I think, okay, so last thing we're gonna do, I think is just choose research. Actually, I'll stay over here because I don't know what we need for research. Let's just fix that. Oh, not this, excuse me, this, thank you. Um, we need the, uh, no, transportation. We need this, this is good. So that is crude wheel. And then maybe we need the brickworks as well. And that's going to be sand. Ugh. Not a fan of carrying sand, but that's okay. Um, it's hard because you have to, like, mess with it. <laughs> okay, I'm going to throw this uh, side into the giant mouth of doom. Because that's fun. Look at this. This is funny. This is hilarious. No longer are we limited by our forestry. We are fine. Oh, hey. Hey, guess who I can talk to? How you doing? Can I? Oh, I need to stop before I can tell it to stop. Hey there. I'm gonna steal your bucket. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I like this. I like this method. This is very good. Wow, I cannot put it in my... Really? Backpack? Yo? Yes, I can. Okay, good. Um, crude wheel. Do we have those made? We do. Nice. All right, now we're gonna go and get our research going. Oh, look at all the kitty winks. They're happy kids, happy colonists. Let's go quickly and get this going. Sand, yes. Oh, whoops, that's the wrong one. Here we go with this one, hooray. And sand, boom. And another bucket, which I always end up with multiple buckets up here. <laughs> Anyway, I think that's good for an episode. I hope you've enjoyed this. I've, I've made the garden gnomes. We couldn't make mo much of the other stuff. It's a bit higher level than we have at the moment. But anyway, I think they're really, really cute. All those little gnomes, the Gnarden gnomes. They're just sitting there and having a good time. So anyway, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.